welcome back to HD Gaming. I am HyperDiamond100, and today we're back with some more cooking simulator. Now, there's a fun announcement, as some of you may know, that a cooking simulator pizza update is coming out soon. I cannot wait. Now, today, we're gonna try a new thing the Winter Holidays Extra Game Mode. We are going to see how this works. It says to make a Christmas dinner. We're gonna try just two guests, the maximum time limit, and a tutorial on. Let us see how this works. All right, so we're in, and it's telling us that our guests have preferences. Select a recipe that includes the product of their choice to please them. It's super effective. You need to assign recipes to guests. Oh, do it early on to keep track of what you need to do. You can change mine at any point before the dinner. The more difficult dish you choose to serve, the happier guests will be. The dinner won't begin until all guests have been served their dishes. When your dish is ready, but you don't want to cool down, place on a heat retaining plate so it stays warm for as long as you need. And every time you finish a dinner, your dinner score increases against your total score. Check out the leaderboard to your rank against your friends. This looks to be a continuous thing. Perk selection. Can I do all of them? I mean, I pick all of them. Two guests. Okay, there's a guest to you. His preferences is zucchini. Oh, I don't know how to make most of this stuff. Oh, gods. Fast ratatouille. How does this work? What is rat- uh, Ha ha ha. I don't know what I'm doing. Where's the other guy? Other guy? Where is he? Oh, I'm just blind as a bat. Here he is. He wants parsley roots. He gets Ukrainian borscht because we know how to make that. The only thing that zucchini is in is ratatouille. I mean, I guess we can try it. All right, guys, we gotta do this fast. Okay, good, there's an order manager. All right. What the, what? Oh, no. Oh. Ukrainian borscht's, uh, seems to be fully leveled up, guys. Uh, we bit off more than we can chew here. By fully leveled up, I mean, you can level up dishes in this. I should have known it wouldn't be that easy. Here we go. Simple Ukrainian borscht. That's what I was looking for. Right. Alright. Got a pot. Adding chicken broth. Ukrainian borscht is simple enough. Oh, I just realized this is going to meet his preferences. Wait. Yes, it is. I was just confused. Salt, pepper, beetroot, onion, carrot, and this guy's preference, the parsley root. And timer is a go. That's a really cool stove. This is such a nifty kitchen. Well, that cooks. Just go on a quick tour. Counter, counter, with sing. Fun fry thingies. Awesome stove. Hot plate, or counter, recycling bin, pantry, dining room. Alright, now, we have to figure out how to make this fast ratatouille. Oh, oh boy. We gotta add stuff to a food processor, blend, add it to a pot, boil, transfer into a casserole. What have I gotten myself into? Alright, supposed to add some stuff to the food processor. A little bit of olive oil, onion, garlic. Red bell pepper, yellow bell pepper. Ah! Hurry! Get that borscht! Done. Ooh. Uh, overcooked it a little. That's fine. That's fine. We're all fine. It seems to have survived. Ah! Oh, no. Did I just dump this out? By accident? No, no, no! to the ratatouille. Last step was to add a tomato. Oh, I can't believe I bungled the borscht like this. What next? Blend. You mean blended like my heart? <laughs> Alright, it's blended. Add to a pot. Boop. Add salt and pepper. And some spice that I'd never heard of before. Now we set it to cook for exactly 60 seconds. 
In the meantime, let's resurrect our borscht. Broth, salt, pepper, turn this off. Now what do we do with that? Transfer into a casserole. Is that a plate? Wait, where do I find plates in this kitchen? Oh, in here. Casserole. Casserole. There it is. Ooh, cute little plate. Transfer into casserole. Okay. There we go. Alright. I poured it in the casserole and it overflowed. Then I want some other stuff. Okay. Uh, we'll get to that in a second. Back to the borscht. Beetroot, onion, carrot, parsley root, and back on the stove. Alright, ratatouille. Roasted vegetables. Take an eggplant and a zucchini. Chop. Put on a tray. You too, zucchini. Get a tomato. Cut it up. Add it to the tray. Hmm, might be in a bit too many pieces there. Borscht is done. Alright. With the borscht successfully finished, we shall transfer it into the standard deep plate. Hey, and with that, I can serve it. You, guy, have I, how do I serve you? Ah, oh, that's how. Alright, he served, I think. Back to the ratatouille. So, it turns out that you're supposed to first bake it then remove, well not remove, we were supposed to bake the zucchini and eggplant, then add the tomato. So, I'm gonna do that now. Got the thingy off. Got my trusted timer. And, um, now we wait, I guess. Because there's nothing else we can do. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. Done. Alright, that's done. Okay. Those kind of look cooked. Not really. That's okay. Adding way too thin tomato. Closing. Grabbing timer. Timing. Waiting! Alright, alright. Done, done, done. That actually looks really well done. The eggplant's like a millimeter overdone, but uh... I'm amazed. The vegetables actually cooked perfectly. What do I do with them? Transfer it into... This? Seriously? I add them to this liquid? Uh... Okay. This doesn't look like ratatouille. It look, it, the tomato is phasing through the bowl. You know what? Oh, he's eating it. Oh, that's alarming. That's alarming. Oh, he's eating it. It's making crunching noises. I did it. Yo. Oh, this guy loved it. Perfect flavors, perfect technique, perfect temperature. What about him? Ah, yes. Bad cutting technique. I mean, what did I expect? I did that pretty fast, uh, I think. I actually, though, do think that works out really well. Um, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Um, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe. Uh, comment down below if I should do a part two, maybe this time with, like, eight guests. Oh, the pain and suffering that would have used. Alright, uh, thank you all for watching. See you all next time. Bye.